Hi, this is Roshobi. Uh, we're doing another short uh, video log. Uh, this is uh, some comments that I've received um, in the uh, comment section uh, of my YouTube channel that sort of asked me the question uh, about uh, to what extent do I uh, am I committed uh, to the hobby? Now, to be honest, guys, um, not everybody can. Uh, in fact, uh, I should say not anybody. Nobody can sustain uh, going after all watches that they love to see. That let's be honest about it. Uh, for me, I have. I think I have uh, starting to reach uh, my limits, and in the next couple of months, I was you will start to see some of my uh, collection being sold. So uh, I'll put it up on my uh, website some of the watches that uh, I'll be putting up for sale um, but in reality uh, this is the typical cycle of a um, watch collector um, at the start you are 100% committed to the hobby you acquire uh, sometimes you trade but more often than not you collect and after a while uh, you started to realize that a number of your uh, collection are quite similar in nature and and your original idea of collecting something that is unique to, to individual pieces um, becomes very uh, convoluted so in my case I'm feeling the same uh, I'm starting to see that a number of my watches are similar very similar to each other so I will start to pare them down uh, to make sure that I've got a collection that is individual pieces are unique, specific for certain uh, specifications. Anyway, um, that's all I have to say for today. Um, follow the channel, uh, and if there's any comments, uh, do put it in the uh, comment section. Anyway, goodbye.